lunatic, delusional, dreamer, funny guy, inspirational, dickwad, awesome, whatever name you've thrown at me the past so years, there's only one that stays synonymous with me, Eddie motherfucking Bainey, because that's who I am, nothing more, nothing less. You know, this Sunday night is WWE's premier event, Money in the Bank. One of the biggest pay-per-views, special events of the year. Why does that fucking matter? And why do any of you care? Well, I'm going to tell you that this Sunday, one of them men, and in my heart, it's going to be Dean Ambrose, is going to drop, drop this five other guys, and he's going to drop them with the dirty deeds. He's gonna do what was said could, couldn't be done because he is a lunatic, he is delusional, he is unstable. But as he stands over their bodies, he's gonna climb that ladder and do what he said he was gonna do since he's entered the WWE. He's gonna win, he's gonna grab that briefcase, get one step closer to his world title, or he's gonna die trying. Why is that symbolic to me? Well, I'll tell you why. Because for the past few years, I've been saying whatever I want, whether it's the love of my life, who's God knows where, whether it's my dreams, whether whatever it is, that I am going to grab them by the horns or I'm gonna die trying. Today's the day I, I, die, I start doing or die trying. Dean Ambrose, John Moxley, John Good, whatever you want to call him, has been one of my idols and inspirations for about the past seven to ten years, about the past decade, if you will. So, believe me when I say this, this weekend is my weekend, and it's the perfect weekend to go out, if somebody gets in my way, drop them with their dirty deeds, give them that lunatic look, Climb that ladder, grab that briefcase, and get one step closer to cashing in on, on my world title in life. So, with that being said, what is it you're going to do, Eddie? Well, I'm going to look for my judge on social media first off. I'm going to see to it that who's ever in charge of his PR team gets that video that I made about a live-action Beavis and Butthead movie. I'm going to send that in. Okay, and I ask of you, anybody who's walking with me throughout this journey, if you happen to have a Twitter handle and have Mike Judge on Twitter, please send him that link. It's the video that that is captioned live action Beavis and Butthead movie. Somebody call Mike Judge. It's worth a shot, man. Like I said, whoever supported me since day one and day one meaning the moment you entered my life. You're coming with me. Now, there's going to be a lot of people who say, oh, yeah, Eddie, I had your back. Oh, yeah, you had my back when you walked out, right? When I was too unstable for you. Now, look at me. I got my shit together. I know what I'm doing, and I'm fucking in charge. I'm off drugs, and I'm going through with a vision that I've had the past three years that I never deviated from. I may have made mistakes along the way. I may have stumbled over myself, but God damn it, as God is my witness, I've gotten back up each and every single time. And now that I'm stronger than ever and you see greatness, you want to come in my face and say, oh, I supported you the whole time. Yeah. The only thing you'll get from me is jizz. Sell it on eBay. It might be worth, might be worth $500,000 one day. That's about the only thing you get from me. You know, I don't care whether you're with me or against me. Train's rolling. It's in full force. And why not this weekend? Why not this? Why is this not the perfect weekend to go out and reach for the stars? So I'm going to do that. Because you know why? Just like WWE, life is kayfabe. We all write the scripts of our lives. We all have the ability to put ourselves over. It can all be scripted. It can all, you know, and, and in a way it's unfair, but some of us just have that natural ability to know, hey, 
You know, this is part of life. There has to be a winner. There has to be a loser. Why not just make it to where we elevate ourselves to the top and win and put ourselves over? Sometimes you have to. But while doing that, don't ever forget where you came from and don't forget to put the little people who helped you get there over as well. It's your weekend, guys. What a better weekend than now to follow your heart, reach for your dreams, and own it like it's yours because it is yours, man. Take it. But don't take my advice. Do it on your own, Will. Wild Card 3 out.